Hi officers, in this short video I would like to talk about ballast water treatment system modes. To get a bonus I recommend you to watch this video until the very end. So let's clarify together. There are two types process modes, IMO mode and United States Coast Guard mode and their purpose to set the system to be compliant with legislation in the USA, United States Coast Guard mode or the rest of the world IMO mode, International Maritime Organization mode. Remember that local rules might be in some ports, countries or states, even having the best certified water treatment system, port authorities can prohibit deballasting in inland waters. I can freely state this since I faced with this on my previous contract where we were calling to the New Zealand. After sending the pre-arrival ballast report, we received a reply from local authorities There are stated no deballasting allowed. The reason was not mentioned. In addition, let's refer ballast system manual Alpha Laval version 3.2 on the page 46 and you see now it's also note that all issues are not applicable for all vessels also note that this is a general compilation for each vessel it is also important to consider if their applicable requirements may by the following list below as I mentioned IMO Coast Guard United States EPA means Environmental Protection Agency this is Environmental Agency of United States. Some particular states in the USA, your flag state and classification society, and also complaint operation, etc. Depending on your trade line or destination, the concrete method must be used. At present, I mean nowadays, when destination is outside United States waters, obviously I'm a mode to be used. When you are heading to United States, sure United States Coast Guard mode should be applied. If some ballast taken previously under IMO mode, it's supposed to be deballasted and ballasted under Coast Guard mode. Irrespectively, you are going to deballast in US waters or not. At this point, some interesting thing to be applied, like holding time. Before uptake ballast, your treatment will ask you what method you intend to use the three days or zero days what does it mean let's refer to official documentation three days the time between a completed ballast and the start of the ballast of stripping must be at least 72 hours so this means after ballasting at least three days water must be remained untouched in tanks or your tank Based on my experience, I had enough time to comply with this mode before arrival in USA, since we have long trip, yeah, at least about 10 days. Okay, this is a bit deviated. And the second is zero day hold time. That means time between completed ballast at the start of the ballast or stripping must be at least two and a half hours. This means after ballasting at least two and a half hours water must be remained untouched in tank or tanks and uh, in this case also while such uptake UV lamps work on maximum power providing supreme water treatment so it means that for vessels uh, which has a very short voyage before arrival and they have to be compliant so they have to use this zero day mode holding time and I would like to warn you also one important thing exact pure alpha laval yeah what I have currently on board is full circle of treated water means when you ballast with treatment system and deballast. It means if you ballast using treatment system and deballast bypassing the treatment system, it means non-compliant because you are bypassing the treatment system when you deballast it. Just now we discussed the treatment modes. As I promised, as a bonus under this video, you can download system manual for pure ballast water treatment system Alpha Laval with version 3.2. There are much of useful information. It contains about 600 pages. And this Alpha Laval, on my experience, I mostly faced with. Moreover, as well, in description, you can find useful links 
on my videos concerning using ballast water treatment systems Costco Blue Ocean Shield this is my previous contract bin and uh, it contains also useful practice tips comment share like subscribe thank you for watching see you in next content bye bye